fire. Get this thing moving. I need to get out of here now. Yes, Mr. Salah. As quickly as possible, sir. Salah. Decontamination team to level one airlock now. Intruder alert. through their comms network. What's going on down there? There's been an accident in the manufacturing wing. The whole place is falling apart. I need you to find me an exit. I already have one for you. You've got to make your way to the pump rooms at the base of the complex. This area is dense with natural springs. The pumps don't only supply it with water, but also keep it from flooding. You know you're in what's probably the most extensive chemical and biological weapons manufacturing facility I've ever seen. I gathered. I'm going to try and work out a way to contain the chemicals. If they escape the facility, we're all dead and buried. There's an airlock lift that links the floor you're on with the lower level, and then a smaller lift connects that floor with the pump rooms. Locate the airlock and get down there. I'll be back in touch. Salah's trapped in the airlock, Kim. Looks like he's between you and the way out then. I'm going to see if I can't get this door open for you. Unless they're next to a comms point, all the rest you'll have to take care of yourself. Need to find the fuse box.
failing. This is it. Ideas. I've got diagnostic access, but I can't see why it's not working. There's just no power to it. The controls are situated around the central shaft. You'll have to restore power before you can use it. Out.
got it. I will be in storage A. Send reinforcements. Here? You hold him here. Yes, sir. Stop it! Move! Salah! Kill him! Kill him! Be what?
the pass. close to the lift down to the pump rooms. I can see the lift. There's a fire blocking the way. Hang on. Chemicals are leaking everywhere, Kim. Make sure you have a hazmat suit on before you go in. Whatever it is Salah's been concocting, I think we can assume it wouldn't do you any good. Uh. Once you're in the pump rooms, I'll be back in touch. Out. Uh. Not the clock. Not the clock. 